On the topic of KD, did you watch the interview he did with his uh, manager? There was one point that I thought was pretty interesting and it was tying into what we were speaking about last episode about what we would do to change the All-Star game to make it more competitive and whatnot. He mentioned how excited he is to play in the summer for the Olympics. Right. Immediately, as soon as he said it, he said, so he said that, if I remember correctly, you're going to have the best players of Team USA playing together all in the camp, playing for more than one game. So he was taking a stab at the All-Star game, saying that it's just the one exhibition game. Mm -hmm. We had a lot of ideas as to how we would fix the All-Star game. It made me think, look, the way I see it is maybe the middle of the season isn't the right time for the All-Star break. Maybe, and uh, and we spoke about this, you and I, um, earlier yeah. in the week, maybe they <coughs> should push it till the after the finals. Maybe they should have it in the summer where a lot of the players are getting into uh, doing their reps with, you know, whether it be... Um, Drew League. Drew League or other leagues where they're playing against, you know, amateurs and whatnot and they're putting in you know youtubers big numbers maybe this is the time where they can actually be semi-competitive get their reps in and we film it keep them be ready and we yeah, film yeah. it and yeah. that becomes like the moment to do the all-star break if he's excited about playing in the summer you know and others are playing uh, excited about playing in the summer and it gives them enough time to recover because I think that's one of the big things that a lot of, even though, even though I know the stats don't show it, um, the stats suggest that people don't get injured in the All-Star game. I, I know all these points. Yeah, why? Get the reps in so it doubles, it has a dual purpose and we get to see that. You know, the, the fans get to enjoy that. 